Hi everybody, it's Diane. I haven't made a video for a while. And I know sometimes when I say that, you might be saying, well, you just put one up yesterday. What are you talking about? I have gaps. My husband edits them. And then I put, you know, I do put the videos up in order, but I don't necessarily wait four days. You know what I mean? And then put up the next one. I just put them up as I get them. So that's it. But anyway, I was going to do a little catch up and then we're going to have a glue session. I covered my washi boxes thanks to Christina Shack for inspiration to do that. And it was five. I mentioned in some video I've got four to cover. No, it was five. I'm kind of embarrassed to say. They're not perfect. I didn't do the bottoms. I left the edges raw so they would open easily. But I did do different colors so I can tell what they are. Because the way I have them stored, if I label them, I'm not going to see the labels anyway. I just can't see them. So we have browns, amber. We have kind of multi-neutral. We have just text. I think that's kind of cool. We have blue. That's pretty. And then we have multi-bright colors. And I admit they look a lot better than like this. Okay. Let me put these aside. Okay. I've also been making a lot of little mini, nothing fancy journals. These are going to be the covers. But I thought maybe grouping them together for my Etsy shop for stocking stuffer type gifts it might be kind of cute. So I've been busy with that. I ordered some postage stamps off Etsy. I haven't done that in a long time. I have to go through those. <laughs> okay, let's glue. Oh, and it's like uh, 58 degrees here. <laughs> I don't think it's been that. I've said that since April. It is supposed to go back up after today, but yeah, it's chilly. Okay, we have a little bear cut from that Sears catalog when I was making the postage stamps. I found that. And then a scrapbook paper bear that I might have. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's that, but it's smaller. Okay, I'll use it anyway. So where can we put these? Well, how about right there? Okay, I told you all my news, so I have nothing else to talk about. Well, we're still painting, although it's the home stretch, finally. Looks very nice. And then I discovered, I don't think my dining room curtains are going to match the new paint color. <laughs> I did not think about that. They're, they're just tan. You know, what doesn't go with tan? Like a yellowy sand color. That's what the walls are, and they don't match. Yay. All right, this. Well, I did have a miscellaneous page in my other book that has a bear on it. But maybe we'll do that instead. Okay. Okay, now I have nothing to talk about. Well, I'm sure no one's interested in this, but I reopened my used bookstore on Etsy. It's called Dust Jackets, if anyone's interested. There's not a lot in there, but there's some nice books. I started that right before the lockdown thing, you know, of 2020. And I sold a few things, but not a lot because of that. And then I wasn't, you know, thrifting or anything to buy books. So I put the shop on uh, vacation mode for a while. So it's back. We'll see. If it doesn't do so great, I guess I'll give it up. I have these two. Uh, they're pumpkins made out of book pages I found in a magazine. Well, I think I'll keep them together, in which case that's not going to work. Well, that's 
kind of cool. Yeah, I said kind of, didn't I? I put my fall wreath on my front door. There's big news. It's okay. I, I don't know, though. I think it cuts off too much of this pumpkin. Okay. I think that's probably it. I have, well, maybe these would fit. I have a couple cookie things and one that I know one is too tall. Okay. Actually, I don't know why that's like that anyway. Why is that like that? Cookies don't do that. It's not a cookie pie. I don't know. Actually, that fits pretty nicely there. See, ye of little faith. I didn't think cookies would work in this one. Okay, oh, I have one strawberry. <laughs> Scrapbook paper. Uh, let's see if you can find that bait. It, technically, it's fall, so I don't have a marker on it anymore. I don't know if I have one of these in here or not. Uh, is there a, another place that needs it more? Like there. Okay, that. These pages are pretty uh, cool. <laughs> How's that for an original word? I don't know. I think that's pretty cool. And I would like to point out you know, I'm doing, I did these just the way I do everything else. I just pieced and pieced and pieced. I did not do it all at once, and it still worked out pretty well, I think. Okay, the newer one. Oh, wait a minute. I had a D. Is that in this one? Yeah, okay. Just saw that in a magazine and I knew one of them had D's in it. I don't think I have to tell you why, right? Good, good, good. Okay. All right. Well, I have a couple USA things, and those pages are getting really full, as we know. A sticker and just the word American. How big is this sticker? Should fit. Uh, I think way down there it fits very well. So we'll do that. All right. Oh, you can even see it. I'm so impressed. Okay, and then this word. That's not bad. Well, I think it's there or nowhere. It's nowhere, man. <laughs> How about over a little bit? I do not have ice cream, so we can move on right away here. All right, that looks pretty good. Okay, I have a couple horses, but I do have other horse pages. I don't know. Yeah, I don't think this is going to work on here. I may be on this stuff. That's okay. 
And once again, I'll say it, I didn't realize I had this much stuff to glue. I thought of doing a glue book session, I don't know, a few days ago, and I didn't look. I thought, I know there's not enough stuff. There probably was. Okay, good. Come here. And while I'm thinking of it, you know, there are little horses in here that are a little, little skimpy, I'm trying to say. That one, no, that one was done. Am I making this up? <laughs> Then you're gonna, oh here okay no I wasn't making it up well I guess that's full okay I didn't remember I did finish it off okay doesn't hurt to check these things all right right there Yeah, this is pretty little, isn't it? Okay, good. I have some architecture stuff. I have an old false front building there. That's good. And another stucco thing and that's a painting. Old painting and another postage stamp. Oh, it's okay. It's, we're not really missing anything there. Want to do that? Okay. I haven't found a dragon in a long time. Remember, I was finding them left and right there, and I kept saying, I can't believe I'm finding all this dragon stuff. Now it's cooled off. I'm not finding any. All right. This. Well, it's nice and crooked, number one. Whoops. Number two, maybe we don't need all that sky on top. And I'll share this trick I did once before, but if you know where you want to cut, I mean, you, you know it's just a sliver, check the back. You might have a line or text or something that makes it easier to cut <laughs> straight, Lee. There's your glue trick for today. Yeah, that's better. Although, do we want this down here by this other stucco thing? Yeah. And that's, see, that's not helpful. <laughs> Just in case you didn't know. All right. Okay, what am I going to do with the false front then? I don't know. Hmm. I also have the arch thing. Well, that fits there, but you don't see it. <laughs> yeah, I don't like that. Well, I had these two. Do I have, you tell me. Do I have windows? Yeah, I do have windows in here. Okay, windows or doors. All right, we'll put those here. Oh, that's pretty good. Well, there's buildings here, although I put it here because of the windows, really. I don't know, maybe we can work with these other things here. It's 
things are like perfectly. That's sort of scary. Okay. I don't know, would these look out of place? It's not a window or a door. Yeah, I think they look out of place. How fussy can you possibly be, Diane? We're finding out. Okay, I don't like that. We'll put it with those. <laughs> uh, the funny food thing. I don't know. I've got SOS pads. It's not really a food, is it? No, it's not. <laughs> but I meant because it's old and it's like, you know, I've got tang, although it's a food. Well, all right, then where's the packaging? Well, all right, I'll just put it way over there. Way over there, out of the way. And I forgot to look at the... I, I have a timer set for my oven, and I knew it was on a half hour, except I didn't look at the clock when I came back here. <laughs> so, I'm either going to stop early or you're going to hear a beeping. All right, that's a little gluey. Okay, let's go back. Well, would that go here? It would, but I don't like it. Okay. I have a little bulldog that should fit on here. How about right there? Yeah, so not only is it cool, it's windy and rainy. <laughs> cool and sunny would be kind of nice, but it's not. I don't think I have anything for this stuff. Okay, well, I glanced up at the camera and it had a message. So I had to stop it and take the camera down so I could read it. And it says, you have a low battery. It wasn't in his little cradle correctly, I guess. And I didn't notice that. I'm sorry. Anyway, I put these flowers in, which I thought looked pretty good there. And I do have a chocolate. And I think that's the only possible place it could go. Oh, uh, what do you think? That's okay. Okay. And by the time I was done goofing around with the camera, I had to leave. So this is like over five hours later. So if I forgot or I repeat or whatever, that's why. The weather has not improved any in that time. Okay, that actually looks pretty good. I think that's the only chocolate thing I have. Halloween. Well, okay, you tell me. It's Snoopy and it's Halloween. So such dilemmas. Does, <laughs> does it go on here where it doesn't fit? Hmm. Okay, or <laughs> I also have this. It was an ad for chocolate milk. They're all holding chocolate milk. Do I start a new page? Yeah, I think we sort of have to, don't we? All right, let's find. Well, All right, I think, oh, this was a tag on a uh, dish towel, kitchen towels. 
I think I'll trim the top of that a little bit and put that there. And then I trimmed off the bottom writing and stuff, but these were on it. So we'll do something like that. I'll glue that by myself. And as long as we're here, I did, you know, last time I was sort of saying, I don't know if I'll put those cookies on there. I went ahead and did it. So I found <laughs> Live Your Life and Go Ahead Live a Little. So I thought those sort of went with Let Yourself Go. Oh, that's not bad right there. It's a little crooked. Yeah, I'm good at that. It's sort of bowing because I started cutting it too short, so I had to make room for these taller letters. You think by now she'd be aware of that? Yeah, I'm aware that I do it all the time, but I don't correct it. <laughs> I don't stop doing it. How about that? So I don't know, what else are we going to put on this page? Are we going to go with the cookie junk food thing? I don't know. Or try to look for more sentences like this, phrases. I had to cut that apart. It was below it. Well, in the painting yourself into a corner, I think I'll do that. I do think it stopped raining. It, well, it wasn't really raining. It was more like misting all day. I think it stopped doing that. I don't think it went up any degrees at all. Come here, I can't get the end there. Oh yeah, the first time I started this, I did not get a wet paper towel. So once I was paused there, I thought to myself, all right, when you come back, get a wet, pa wet paper towel. Well, if I can't say it, I guess that clues you in that I didn't do it. Okay, I did have a stack of cookies. But they are Christmas, does that matter to anybody? How about that? Okay, she does look pretty good. I usually make Christmas cookies with sprinkles at Christmas time, but they're not this thick. It, the recipe I have is you roll, you know, roll it. I guess those are like sugar cookies. I have done that too. Now that I think of it, make, just make sugar cookies but put red and green sprinkles on it. I have done that, but those look better than mine. Okay, now that we're all thrilled with that statement, I think that's it for this. Um, this big dog here. I'm not a real fan of costuming your dog, but I think that's CGI stuff, don't you think? I don't, those sunglasses don't look like they're really on him. So I thought that was acceptable. Okay. at my thrift store and I picked up one magazine. I mean,
mean, a couple other things. But as far as magazines go, I only found one I thought was collage worthy. And this was in that. Good. Okay. Chairs. Get back in there. I do have a couple chairs. I hope they fit. And I have a little tiny word chair. That certainly will go somewhere. That's out of that Sears catalog again. And that's just a little picture. That was cool. Okay, it fits. It's crooked. Still a little crooked, don't tell. All right, the rocking chair. Okay, how about there? Yeah. I have seen some cool chairs in magazines, but they're way too big. So I left them where I found them. I didn't cut them out. Are you proud of me? All right, and this little tiny word. Okay, now the storage was full. That's it. I gave up. <laughs> I'm usually pretty tenacious. I gave up. I gave up. The little video was getting long anyway. So I went ahead and put everything in so you can see. I'll take you through. I put in the word cookies down here. This is the old one. I had one cat I had forgotten about, this circle. So I filled in, that was sort of an awkward line there anyway. So I think that looks pretty good. And you can't possibly miss this. I put in the word Christmas. <laughs> okay. I cut that arched window we had a brown arch I cut out the church and I put it here I think that looks pretty good um, I saw this was ripped I re-glued it <laughs> I put this here I may leave that totally like that I don't know that's kind of neat uh, you already saw that Uh, chocolate you saw okay I did put those book pumpkins here and then I have three of these the other two are in the back it's Vermont Country Store catalog covers are very cool these are from a few years ago I don't know if they still do this but anyway I had saved them for you know some cool collage project and obviously I never did anything with them so I glued them in here I'm hoping somewhere along the line I can find something to fit over that. But that's pretty darn cool. Oh yeah, my Halloween tab had come off, so let's put that back there. Okay. The Old West false front building I put here because keep the West wild. That looks good. That's my neighbors barking and talking. Uh, what did I do here? I just pulled it out. Oh, an eagle down there. Okay, this page that's going nowhere, I put that arch painting there. I added two pieces of pie to our disgustingly sweet page. Uh, vintage vault, I think that's a store. I just thought that was cool, so I just cut that out. Uh, you saw that, I think. <laughs> I glued this in. That's in. And then here's those other two covers. And they have the same circular thing. I'm hoping at some point I can cover up. I think that's it. 
Oh no. I started another Christmas page. I know. I wasn't going to do that. But I found this stuff and I do like it. So we'll see. It doesn't have to be strictly Christmas. I could add different things. But I put that in and then this is a copy of a playing card I have. And I don't know why I had it. There is a mate to it that has the Queen of Hearts and the Cheshire Cat on it. I don't know why I copied that. Why it's by itself. I don't know. Anyway, it's in here. And that scrap of paper. I thought that was pretty cool. Okay, considering what time of year it is, I'll leave you with that. I'm sorry for the technical errors in this video. What can I say? Thanks for watching, everybody. And I hope you have a very nice day.